Hey guys, it's Infrared God, and I'm back with another Pokemon Brick Bronze video. This time, I'll be talking about the copy known as the Return of Hoopla again, but instead of reviewing it, I'll be providing suggestions so that the copy can grow further. It's only at about 2,000 members right now, which is pretty good considering it was at 1,100 a week ago, but I feel like it deserves a lot more players than it gets. So. I'll be providing some tips so that it can grow even further. Before I actually go into what the return of Hoopa should fix, let me list some stuff the devs did right for this copy. They have all 8 gyms, they have Gen 8 Pokemon incorporated into their game. The game lasts for quite a while, and even though that might be due to the player base's small size, it's re-uploaded fairly quickly even if it's taken down. They also have a custom UI, and they widened out the FOV during battles so that it looks nicer. Now it's time for the stuff I think that the return of Hoopa should fix. Firstly, the player's animations are broken for walking, even though NPCs have perfect walking animations. This might be due to a Roblox update because Roblox updates are known for messing with code, but since I complained about it in my Project Bronze Victors video, I have to mention it here. The bag UI also seems to lack proper borders, so it's kind of hard to navigate. This isn't that big of an issue, but Having borders for the bag UI would make it look just as good as everything else. Kinda underwhelming compared to the rest of the UI, which looks great. Those are the major bugs that I wanted to cover, and the rest of these are just gonna be personal suggestions that I think would help the return of Hoopa grow. Firstly, I think that the addition of codes would be nice. I'm not suggesting that you make a bunch of broken codes giving shiny, perfect PvP legendaries, <coughs> PBS, but Codes definitely attract more players, and having codes would definitely make the return of Hoopa look like a copy worth playing to new players. I've mentioned multiple times how I like the custom UI, but during battles, the cards for the Pokemon on the field look a bit small, and the HP under the player's health bar looks kind of crammed. I think that if you make the image slightly bigger for their cards, it would make the UI look a lot nicer. You might be asking why I made a full video about minor issues that this copy has, and that's because I want it to grow. It only has, like I said, about 2,000 members, and I think it deserves at least 5,000 or even 10,000. A large player base will motivate devs to work on their game, so if we want the return of Hoopa to stay up, we're gonna need to give it more players. And that's all I have for today's video. Thank you for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace.